friends welcome to my channel my name is Wolo I want to say thank you to everyone who has subscribed to my channel and have seen my videos as usual I love to share information about life in Canada and immigrating to Canada for people who will find it beneficial today I'll be talking about the New Brunswick Provincial Nomination Program and um, it's a program that has a link or a connection with the AIPP and for anyone who doesn't know what AIPP means it means Atlantic Immigration Pilot Project. The Atlantic Immigration Pilot Project is a project that um, was started by the Canadian government to attract workers from outside of Canada into Canada, into the Atlantic provinces in Canada, uh, where they get um, valid job offers. And then with the valid job offers, they can then apply for permanent resident status. So it's an employer driven program, which means the employer will look for people and hire those people. And then they come to Canada as permanent residents uh, through the AIPP. My focus is on New Brunswick because from time to time, New Brunswick organizes information sessions outside of Canada. They choose different countries where they go to and organize information sessions where they talk about life in New Brunswick and how to settle in New Brunswick. And the good thing about these information sessions is for people who attend these information sessions outside of Canada, they have about 80% to 90% um, possibility of getting a provincial nomination from New Brunswick with which they can, you know, add to their express entry profile and get an invitation to apply and come into Canada as permanent residents. So, Every time they publish the destination they go to for the information session. And recently they've advertised the places they will go to for their information session. So when they go for these information sessions, um, companies who are based in New Brunswick also organize career fair or job fair where they do recruitment and hire people and give them work permits to come to Canada to work and while they're in Canada, they can then apply for permanent resident status using the AIPP, which is the Atlantic Immigration Pilot Project, and then they become permanent residents. So I'll be showing you the websites to go to register and they also have their occupation in demand. They are looking for people in certain occupations um, such as truck drivers and um, physiotherapists, registered nurses, psychologists, and managers in healthcare. They are organizing an information session in three countries, one in Ukraine, one in Poland, and one in Amsterdam. And the requirement is that you need to have a valid visa to these countries. So if you know you are a registered nurse, a physiotherapist, a manager in healthcare, a psychologist, a truck driver, and a carpenter, and you have a valid visa to any of these countries, you can apply. So why I'm sharing this information is because there are lots of people who are already living in these countries and who already have visas to these countries. You can register on the website. I'll be showing you how to do that shortly. You, you should register on that website. And um, if you get the letter to attend try as much as possible to attend the information session when you attend the information session then you'll be eligible to put in your expression of interest and you will get a nomination from new brunswick and then come into canada as a permanent resident so i'll be showing you on their website how to go about registering and then um, expect a letter of um, invitation after registering from them and Ensure that you attend the information session because the criteria to getting the nomination is if you attend the information session and also for those who are in the skilled trades, if you get a job, a valid job offer from the career fair or the job fair that they organize in these um, locations, you can then put in your expression of interest and get a nomination from the New Brunswick province. So to get started, you can go to the living in nb.ca website. Here you will read where it is stated. Below is a listing of our upcoming information sessions and employer-driven recruitment events. 
Participation at all events is by invitation only. There are three types of events which may be posted on this site. The first one is the information session. The second is the job fair. And the third one is the entrepreneurial information session. So what I was talking about was the information session and the job fair. And if you scroll down, they plan on organizing both the information session and the job fair in three places on August 10th, 2019, Monday, August 12th, 2019, and Wednesday, August 14th, 2019. So the first one is in Ukraine, Kiev, Ukraine. The second one is in Warsaw, Poland. The third one is in Amsterdam. So anybody who has a Schengen visa to these places or who is currently living in these places, uh, you can come here and sign up for this event. But there are criteria for you to sign up. So if you are in Ukraine and you click on sign up in Ukraine, the companies that will be participating in this event are looking for transport truck drivers. So companies based in Canada, New Brunswick, will be attending this event to look for truck drivers. You can click here to register and you'll be giving an invite to attend the event. The second location, which is in Warsaw, Poland, they are also looking for transport truck drivers. The third location, which is in Amsterdam, Netherlands, they are looking for transport truck drivers and carpenters as well. And then they're also inviting healthcare professionals in manage, who are managers in healthcare, physiotherapists, psychologists, registered nurses. So if you have a Schengen visa, you should register on this website. So you click here to register and then you find more details. You find more details on what is required. So what you need to register is the data page of your passport, the visa for your country, or the, if you have a Schengen visa, you can include it and then your language test results which is your ielts result your eca report your cv is optional your spouse's cv is optional and then your current driver's license that's for those who are the driver's license for those who are going to be recruited under transport truck drivers category which is the uh, with the NOC code 7511 so basically Companies will be attending the job fair and they will be recruiting transport truck drivers and carpenters. So when you scroll down, register to attend. And if you get a letter of invitation to attend the information session, I encourage you to attend the information session because the information session is critical to getting a provincial nomination from the New Brunswick government. That's the information I want to share. So if you know anybody who, um, whose occupation was shown on the website and who has a Schengen visa, who is living in these areas, please encourage them to apply. Um, you don't know who you might be helping. Encourage them to register on the website. And if they get a letter of invitation for the information session, it's a guarantee. It's a 90%, 100% guarantee that they can put in their expression of interest and they will get a nomination from New Brunswick with which they can you know, boost their scores on their express entry profile and um, get an ITA to Canada um, and apply. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day. Bye-bye.